Good evening, YouTube. This is Dive Fly Fish. Just want to show you an interesting phenomenon noting the piezoelectric effect of zinc oxide. This material, called IRM, is essentially a dental temporary restorative material made of zinc oxide and acrylic. It's normally mixed with eugenol or oil of cloves to form a hard substance as a temporary filling. So, with a magnesium electrode and the negative of the multimeter buried in the zinc oxide with no form of liquid in it, we register zero voltage in the microvolt scale on this multimeter. However, zinc oxide, due to a piezoelectric effect, can function very nicely as an accelerometer. And here you go. So if we take the zinc oxide uh, assembly that I have in my left hand and I move it quickly, you see a microvoltage fluctuation in the cell itself. And this is anhydrous, so there's no fluid in this, otherwise it would be um, solid. In any event, in the crystalline form, again powdered form of zinc oxide, uh, movement produces a microvoltage, an acceleration in both planes, but most notably when you go vertically against gravity, or against the normal gravitational pull, the accelerometer um, type effect raises the microvoltage larger to a larger extent than when I go laterally. So if I go vertically again, we see the microvoltage fluctuation, or if I drop it quickly, we see it, but going up, we see it most pronounced. So in any event, as we place the zinc oxide cell back to ground zero, the microvoltage fluctuation stops. So that is a manifestation of the piezoelectric effect of zinc oxide, utilizing a magnesium electrode and otherwise the negative of the multimeter. So I thought you might find that interesting. Uh, one more small use besides dental use for zinc oxide. There you go. Have a great night.